Ever since the release of Fortnite, there's been some of the craziest items added to the game. From the Infinity Blade immediately demolishing everything in its path, to the Brute stomping on you and your chances of winning. We all can agree there's been incredibly overpowered items added to the game, but there's one item in particular that typically gets forgotten. What's this strange item you may ask yourself? Meet the Zapatron, the shortest lasting weapon to ever be released into Fortnite, only lasting a whopping 30 minutes. The Zapatron was an incredibly overpowered charge up sniper. This weapon could be used as a burst fire or could be charged for a singular very powerful blast. The Zapotron dealt 50 damage for a body shot and a whopping 150 damage for a charge body shot, and to top it all off, dealt 1000 structural damage. If you had a charged up shot, it could be up to 3 times the amount of a regular shot. While there's no particular damage stat for headshots, 150 damage puts this weapon's power into perspective. This weapon only took ammo that was at supply drops called cell ammo. The crazy thing about this weapon is that to date there's only one singular video with a player using the Zapotron. That video video alone was basically the amount of time that the Zapotron was available, and getting something like that on video shows their luck involved capturing it on video. With the rarity of the Zapotron also comes a controversial question. Is the Zapotron even real? Because of the Zapotron's exclusivity and scarce information on this weapon, the Fortnite community often second guesses its existence. On top of all this, like I stated before, there is only one current video of a player using this weapon in game, which in all quite honesty can make it very difficult to believe. The Fortnite community also leans towards the facts of Epic not turning the Zapatron into the game ever since its first release. So the real question is that, is the Zapatron a real weapon or just a made up item? Now the Zapatron is arguably the strangest item to ever be released into Fortnite. Why is that the case though? Well, here's the thing, the Zapotron has little to no information on when or why this weapon was even released in the first place. The only information that we have about the Zapotron's release is that it was brought into update 1.6.3 and was based off an item already in Save the World. The Zapotron was intentionally released to only exclusively be in supply drops, but was quickly vaulted after the Zapotron disabled supply drops. Next update 1.6.4, the Zapotron was then vaulted, but not just that. This strange weapon was put into retirement forever, leaving behind a mystery. To this day, the Zapotron has never made an appearance back into Fortnite, only leaving players questioning its existence. Now this has players asking, why hasn't Epic brought back the Zapotron? The only information that Epic ever stated was that it was vaulted because of the current state of Battle Royale and could have harmed the game's balance. At the time of the Zapotron's release, that would have been a very reasonable excuse. But in today's current state of Battle Royale, I couldn't see why the Zapotron wouldn't fit in. I mean, Epic added overpowered cars that players sat in all games, so why couldn't the Zapotron be added? I could see why the Zapotron wouldn't be added back into the game. But then again, Epic has added some pretty overpowered items, so really anything can happen. Will the Zapotron Zapotron ever make a return? The answer to that question is really not confirmed, but from the looks of it, the Zapotron won't be coming out of retirement anytime soon. What do you think of the Zapotron? Did you know that this weapon existed? The chances of the Zapotron ever coming back are pretty low, but they aren't zero. Comment if you would use the Zapotron if it came back.